welcome back to my channel. It's St. Patrick's Day today. It is March 17th and it's about, I don't know what time it is because I'm outside so I'm gonna look around like I think I know. I think it's about like nine o'clock. Um, so we aren't, we don't really have anything fun planned for today. Uh, so I was an Irish dancer for 14 years. So St. Patrick's Day was always really special, but it was always me performing and going to pubs and stuff and parades and during COVID especially there's not really anything to do like that and especially when you have children that aren't Irish dancers there's not really much to do so we don't have anything planned for today we did do fun stuff yesterday at Disney Springs uh, which I will add in right here Good morning and welcome back to my channel. Today we're at Disney Springs. We're trying some of the St. Patrick's Day festivity stuff Mommy. and seeing what all St. Patrick's Day stuff they have right now. So we're starting with this, I think it's a limeade or lemonade topped with a St. Patrick's Day donut from Everglaze. Do you want to try a drink? No. Try a drink. No. Try a drink, get a drink. How is it? Mm -hmm. Did you not get any? Here, let me stir. So the donut is good. It tastes just like a vanilla donut with the buttercream on top. And apparently it has Star Patch Kids sprinkles. I'm giving Milo little bites of it. But yeah, the lime tastes like blended up Star Patch Kids. I don't know, what you, should I get the pork or the braised short rib? I don't know, we've gotten the pork, but we, I don't think we've gotten the braised short rib. Are you eating the bread, buddy? Yeah. No. I'm going a leprechaun. You're drawing a leprechaun? They're both 12 hour. No, me, I like that. Hey, hey, you guys eat. Now we got the mac and cheese, the kids' mac and cheese, and Ivy got the fish and chips, and I'm sharing. And Zach got the pork with mashed potatoes, and he's sharing the mashed potatoes with Milo. Springs has a special St. Patty's Day menu. It looks like three special drinks. Sorry. Hmm? I'm not on my line. Your feet are red. Your feet are red. Oh, that's nice that they did this. Oh, probably for the summer they didn't do that in the winter because you don't really need refreshments. That's so cute. I love yeah, it. Yeah, it's the Princess. Empire Wasted. That's what that is called. That's cute. What did you say to me? I said nothing. Nothing? I thought you didn't like the Peter Pan ones. I never saw it. I think that's a dog. Yeah. Nana? Sure. 
Yeah, but the odds of her getting the blue hippo are super low. jerseys. They have Minnie Mouse, Pizza Planet, and then a Walt Disney World. Right? I think that's it. Is it? No, they also have a Mickey Mouse. That's cute. So not St. Patrick's Day, but still green. The same with the spirit jersey that I've never seen before. It's kind of like a tie-dye green. Not bad. And they have this like rust colored one. Failure. Guys, come on. <laughs> yeah, no, Chewie's not as cute. <laughs> Today's just gonna be a day of hanging around the house. We're all wearing green, which happens to also coincide with Marshall. So you'll see most of us in our Marshall shirts today, um, just cause it's that perfect like Kelly green. Um, I think we're gonna make some corned beef and cabbage and potatoes. Well, I'm thinking I'm gonna make cool cannon out of the potatoes, but it's essentially corned beef, cabbage and potatoes. Um, I might still make our Guinness cake. Maybe not cause we got those donuts yesterday. The girls are coloring right now, Milo's napping, so yeah, we're just going to take it easy and have a, a little bit of a relaxing St. Patrick's Day. So don't forget to subscribe and I hope you like this video. Milo's first Valentine for St. Patrick's Day and he's celebrating with some plastic cups in his favorite cupboard. I will take those. Thank you. Making our chocolate Guinness and Bailey's sheet cake. Birthday. Not birthday cake, just cake. Uh, not for anyone's birthday, it's no. just cake. Just cake for St. Patrick's Day. St. Patrick's Day. And right now I have the butter in my pocket Toast. warming. Warming to say, um, I'm trying to get it to room temperature, temperature. yeah. Butter! Oh. Have you seen? Um, Happy Shane. Good job. Can you say Happy St. Patrick's Day? Happy Shane. Yeah, perfect. <laughs> yep, that looks good. Whoa. That in. All right, Ivy, do you want to do the salt? Yeah. Uh-huh. All right, you hold that. Okay, sorry. Okay, you want to yeah. do a teaspoon of the salt? Uh, okay, hold it. I'm just aiming it at you. <laughs> you can aim it at Ivy too. And you, I was aiming it at both of you. I'm aiming at you. Okay. Make sure it's all in. Yay! All right. Can you show that? Oh, okay. Right. You stir it up carefully. Eat. Careful. All right, let's get on to the next one. <laughs> 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 All right, you can turn it on. Mm. Uh, 
baby. Why are you doing it so hard? Look, feel how easy it is. Look. You have strong fingers. Right. No, just try. See, not bad. All right, so now that we've taken it out of the oven, it is a poke cake, so we have to poke it. Super hard doing with my left hand, but yeah, you get the gist. So I've started the corned beef and I've chopped up the cabbage. So now I just need to clean the potatoes and chop them up and then cook some bacon for the cold cannon. Um, so we're taking a break outside for a little bit because it's been getting really, really cold in the house. And the house is a mess. I don't know how anybody really keeps the house clean during spring break. It's like impossible. I'm having my second iced coffee of the day. And I tried to make it like an Irish coffee. It didn't work. I didn't, I didn't like it at all. And I'm cleaning all the slip covers on our couches and the cushion covers. So it's like that's everywhere. I still, I've only cleaned that one and put it back on. The rest, like, I need to actually take the whole slip cover off of this. And then the rest of them are... I need the rest of them are out here drying in the sun. Which, they're almost all the way dry. But yeah, we needed them to be nice and clean. But of course, dog hair is still on it. And Penelope and I pulled up a whole bunch of crabgrass that's in this bag. So it's like I, we have all these bear patches now and you can still see all of it over there. But I pulled up a whole bunch over there and I made my fingers like raw and red and blistered from how much that we pulled up. I think that's what Penelope is doing now. I do have for it. Day dinner, we're doing gingerbread cookie. That's all that. He really likes that okay. one. And then pear, which is just pear. Right? Um, num. Mm. If you eat it. Good morning. Yep, there's bacon in there and cabbage. Oh, Ivy just came in here after Zach is, well, he's like putting them to bed and he sent them out here to say goodnight to me and I'm looking at Pokemon stuff. Um, and Ivy blew me a kiss and she said, happy St. Patrick's Day. She's getting so old. I'm so sad. But it was so cute. But yeah, happy St. Patrick's Day. Thanks for watching.